Hello all and welcome back to the X-Files Resist or Serve. We need to find this door for the key. Is that it? No. I think I know where it is. Um, I think it's through here. This door here, yes? Aha! Uh -huh. Okie dokie, that's not good. What is that? I don't like that at all. <laughs> Door is jammed, use the screwdriver. Oh Jesus, what's the code? Eight two four three four. Who killed him? How? Who's here? He can't go back to, he he can't come back to life because I killed him. I don't kill him. Sorry, I basically opened him up. So. He's dead. So who shot him? Observatory key. Okie dokie. Do that, violins. What's that over here? Tanned optical data disc and an iron piece. Briar Lake, this is Alpha. Please respond. We've lost your transmission, Briar Lake. Re establish link. We're waiting for a progress report. What is your situation? Are you in danger? Alpha, this is Briar Lake. We require assistance. Who is this? Immediate disaster relief is needed at Red Falls, Colorado. This is a federal emergency. Ending transmission. Who is this? Okay. Nothing's going on here, so I can't do anything down here. Do I have any items for it? Iron Peace. I have no idea what that's for. Yeah, what's this here? Is 
No, I have no idea. Okay. Lift the floor panel. I can't use that here. What do you mean you can't use that? Oh, hang on. Get away from that. Try this here. You can't use this here. Just use it here. There must be a way to lift the floor panel, yes, I'm trying to. I can't use that here. Okay, so what am I supposed to use? There's an iron piece and a data disk. Okay, I have no idea. It's just here. Okay, what am I supposed to do? Can't magically lift this thing up. There's no point of that, is there? Must be a way to lift the floor panel. Oh. Find that. Oh. Oh. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Magic. Drop the gun, or I'll shoot you where you stand. After I saved your life upstairs, Scully? Krychek, I will kill you. <laughs> Mulder! What's down there? Your future, Mulder. You want to keep talking in riddles, or do you want to tell me what it is? Inside that shell, they're breaking through. There's an artifact. It's alien, Mulder. And I know you feel it. Mulder? Mulder, we have to get out of here. It's ha happening again. Crycheck! Mulder, come on! Mulder! Oh, save point. I'll take that. Oh, 
Okay. You can't stop this, Agent Scully. Help keep him alive. Security office key card. He went that way. But what's this way? Hello. Seems like some form of exercise, that is. God dang it, just die. That's right, this is where Mulder gets to afterwards. Ah. And I unlocked the containment, that's right. Oh, so I get the carbine. Nice. Okay. Okay, damn camera angle, stop. Stop, stop, stop. Ah, oh, come on. Thank you. Oh, hello. Get off me. Jesus, you have a lot of health. Mulder, what happened? What is it? I don't know, but they've taken the artifact. Oh. Fine, you keep him busy. I'm gonna take on the harvest too quickly because I know how to kill this dude real quick. Get off me. Keep 
keep moving. Who sent you? Get them out of here. Tell us what's happening the here. FBI. And this is for your safety. Go. My God, Mondo, look. That's Red Falls. The whole town's in flames. The cover up begins. And we come away with nothing, Scott. What is that? I don't know, but I hope there are answers here. To be continued. Nice. Yes, I'll save it, please. Oh yeah, so I've done that now. I was on resonance now. Root Roush Biotechnologies. Interesting. Okay, let's quickly do this one, I suppose. Mother made contact. He didn't have the reaction we expected. Just the opposite. I don't think Mother's gonna make it. That's unacceptable. The success of the project depends on the life and death of Agent Mulder. I've read both your reports. Despite the efforts of firefighters from surrounding counties, the town of Red Falls was razed to the ground. Agent Mulder, I'm aware of and disturbed by your sighting of Alex Krychek at the Briar Lake facility, as well as the bizarre circumstances under which an artifact he told you was alien in origin disappeared from that facility. An artifact emitting a force strong enough to regenerate life in a three mile radius surrounding Briar Lake. Agent Scully, you mentioned evidence of a toxin? We did encounter a poisonous compound that I believe responsible for most of the deaths in Colorado. Hazmat crews scoured Briar Lake and were unable to come up with anything. The facility was stripped and abandoned. A well-funded program gets a grade A cover-up. I'd look for the union label on this one. Your sarcasm aside, Agent Mulder, I'm trying to help. Now, the three Colorado murder victims you originally went to investigate, their bodies actually made it out of there. I was able to quietly divert them to Quantico. I'll head right over. Good. This may be our only chance of producing tangible evidence. Unless you have something else. No. I have a director's briefing that I'm already late for. If there was a toxin, I want you two to make sure you're not suffering any residual effects. Update me after you've looked at those bodies. And Mulder, I suggest you step back from this case for a while. Okay, so... What was the last ones of these? Hang on. No, we done that one. Yeah, nearly killed in a strange experiment, experimentation chamber. My escape only revealed another mystery. Someone killed the man who trapped me inside. Who did this? Is this another sick twist by Gilnitz? Why would he want me alive? Or is it someone else? Discovered a data disk. Could this hold the answers of the Greenberg spoke of? I must find a way to the basement where Mulder is. Alice Krychek here at Bright Lake. An artifact that claims is... His alien had drawn Mulder into the containment area. Mulder was trapped there and I fear for his life. He appears to be undergoing the same anomalous brain activity that nearly killed him months ago. And then... Next act. Notes for file 7x98. FEMA and CDC personnel responded to Red Falls and Briar Lake, both areas now stripped of all evidence. I don't know how to reconcile the events I witnessed except that 
We may have been exposed to a hallucinogenic toxin. It's my opinion that a poisonous compound is responsible for the deaths at Red Falls. A death preceded by symptoms similar to fentanyl or op opiate gas exposure. Hopefully I can find evidence of the toxin during my autopsies of the Red Falls victims that Skinner was able to bring to Quantico. Whether the object we saw was an alien artifact or what the true goings on were at Briar Lake are all shrouded in doubt because of the appearance of Alex Krychek. He is a murderer and an agent of deception. Mulder is reluctant to inform Skinner about an encrypted data disk I recovered from Briar Lake. We have asked the lone gunman to examine the disk and are awaiting their results. Okay. Mulder, I still don't know why you want to hide the encrypted disk I found at Briar Lake from Skinner. Getting those bodies to Quantico, he clearly wants to help us. It's not that I don't trust Skinner. It's who he reports to. Besides, I'd rather have that disk decrypted outside the normal channels. Scully, time's a wasting. Let's get out of here. Yes, okay, let's get out of here. The assistant director is in a meeting and won't be free for a few hours. I can't remember where to go. Oh yeah, the elevator, I think. It's about time. Hello, man. I'm guessing you cracked the encrypted disk. It wasn't easy. There was some interesting non-linear sequencing to overcome. But the real trick was the language. You mean the programming language? No, we're talking native tongue. Once we broke the firewall, we found the text to be in Russian. Russian? The characters are Cyrillic, but once run through a simple translation sequencer... Voila! Presto changeo! Insert your exclamation of awe here. And buddy, I think you'll want to take a look at this. Tunguska. The Siberian prison camp where you were held and infected with a virus. An alien virus, Scully. Don't leave out that important detail. What does it say? An artifact confirmed to be alien in origin was unearthed recently from the excavation site at Tunguska. Imagine the implications of such a find. Later in the report, it mentions possible experimentation by a corporation known as Rausch Biotechnologies. Do we know their location? There was nothing in the data, but... We could do some nosing around. We'll get back to you. Good work, guys. Well then... Now it seems that Skelly goes elsewhere. Oh, hang on, what was that? Oh, this is Mulder, I think. What was that health kit in there? Nope, just a just a file. Scully, what are you doing? I thought you were going to check out those bodies at Quantico. Yeah, yeah, I do. And the door won't open. Oh. FBI Academy, Quantico, Virginia. This is Dr. Dana Scully dictating an autopsy on one Thomas Sanchez of Red Falls, Colorado. The subject is a 35-year-old white male, 72 kilograms upon intake, and 187 centimeters in height. The body is cold to the touch. Rigor is absent. Lividity is present on the dorsal aspect and fixed. Brian... 
Byers, Langley and Frohickey descripted the data disk from Briar Lake revel revealed the origin, origin of the artifact in, in is Tunguska. I voiced my skepticism to Mulder about the data due to Krychek's involvement but several events in his history provide him a deeper insight. Years ago Mulder was imprisoned within a Russian gulag and infected with a virus he believes was alien, c 4 x 9 this same virus was reactivated in Mulder after exposure to a supposed source of alien energy. His physical reaction at Briar Lake makes him believe the data disk is valid. Is, the disk is valid. A corporation known as Roos Biotechnologies funded the program at Briar Lake. The government will look into Roos Biotech while I move on to Quantico to autopsy the bodies from Red Falls. Quantico, first autopsy, Thomas Sanchez, male victim from Red Falls, Colorado, hypothesis concerning toxin will need to be proven in blood tox screen. Okay. I will use the device found at Briar Lake to measure radiation levels. Gloves, scalpel, let's cut them open first. Radiation went up a bit. Crunchy. All body organs are present and appear in normal anatomic position and relationships. There is so far no evidence of internal blunt force or penetrating injury. A high reading of cosmic galactic radiation. The level appears to also be coming from me. Okay. Cardiopuncture of the left ventricle produces 10 cc's of liquid blood for a toxicology screen. The controller was vibrating like a heartbeat for a bit then. Cosmic galactic radiation levels skyrocketing. Could alien radiation cause our nervous system to produce this tetrotoxin? Tetrodotoxin. Mulder and I have lethal levels in our bodies. Need to produce antidote to counteract toxin effects. Contact Mulder. Oh.
I need some slides. Over here. The report shows levels of a tetrodotoxin like agent, a hormone. If this man was producing a hormone similar to tetrodotoxin, it would have killed him. But the man was strangled to death and the body removed from proximity of whatever was stimulating production. Okay. I need 0.4 milliliters of 1 to 200 epinephrine. I need 0.3 milliliters of 1 to 100 epinephrine. Dang it. Come on, where am I supposed to figure this out? Is there anything? Uh, hang on. Ah, there we go. 0 0.4 mils of 1 to 100. 0 0.3. Yeah, so 0 0.4, 0 0.3, and 0 0.2. 0 0.4, 0 0.3, 0 0.2. Where is it again? Oh, geez, I'm running around. I need 0.4 milliliters of 1 to 200 epinephrine. What? I need 0.3 milliliters of 1 to 100 epinephrine. Point 0.4 I'm sure that was it. I was, I'm dying, I swear. Isotoxin was able to determine the correct doses of epinephrine to create an antidote. 0.4 mils of 1 to 100, 0.3 mils of 1 to 200, and 0.2 mils of 1 to 1,000. But is it different now because it's the... Like an alien toxin. It's a point three of one to one. Maybe it's three to four. I need point four milliliters of one to two hundred epinephrine. Three four two. Nope, I'm dead. Nice. Great. Well, that sucks. I don't know how far back it's going to have to go. I think it's going to be the start of the chapter. Great. Um, anyway, I'm going to have to end this episode here. Hopefully you enjoyed it, and I shall see you all in the next one. So, catch you then.